Hey everyone, it's Elaine, and welcome back to my channel. Today, well, that's Sissy. She's in my spare bedroom with me, where I am staging things to get ready for a retreat. So I wanted to show you one of the ideas that I had. But before that, I want you to kind of look. This is a twin bed that is covered up. And then those bags over there will go. And all of those Panera bags have fabric samples in them. And ooh, I don't know if you can see outside of my nasty patio. But over, let's see if I can do this. Over here and down there, I have boxes of tile and some out on the table that will be coming to the retreat that I will be giving away. This is a lot of door prizes and stuff like that and games and all. Um, but here's what I want to show you. Aren't these the cutest? I have made gift bags out of cereal boxes. And I'm going to see if I can do this one-handed. As you can see, I have a bunch of them. And I haven't put tissue in all of them because I have to travel with them. So I did this just to show you. But here's what I did. I asked my friends for cereal boxes and to not collapse them. So then I take a piece of cardboard and I put down in the bottom of the box to hold it. You know, so as the things pile in there, they don't kind of go through the flap. You know, they don't go through that flap right there. So then what I do is I get my fabric tack out and I glue down each side flap all the way. And then on these other two big flaps, if you remember, I did some soft cover journals and I used this vinyl that came off of some of the fabric samples. So I've cut that fabric into strips and I've glued it along each one of these. And what that does is it makes it sturdier. So then from there, I glue these down to the inside of the box. And then I take my crocodile, and I'll go ahead and get one of these. And I take my crocodile, and I just punch holes. See here. I just punch a bunch of holes in a row that I can put my ribbon through. And then I actually did get this up under the sewing machine and I sewed the ribbon to make the handles on the box. And that's it. That is now my gift bags. What a way to recycle, I thought. <laughs> and I, I used the biggest boxes I had. Now, I'm not going to show you what's inside of them. That's, you know an assortment of things that I have. So I, I can't go through every box because every box is different. But rest assured, they are heavy and they are full. And um, I don't know, it, it doesn't really necessarily matter what's in them because you could do whatever you wanted to do in them. If you actually wanted to use them for birthday presents or whatever down in there, you could. Um, also, they'd be a great size if you wanted to give away a bunch of ephemera, especially if it was like old book pages and things like that, where they could actually lay flat and stand up in there. So anyhow, I just wanted to pop in, like I said, for a short little video and show that to you. And um, it is, I don't know, it, it's, it was a fun project to do and I'm glad I got it done. And with that being said, me and sleepy little sister there are going to wish you a good day. And remember, we do a video every Tuesday evening at 6 p.m. Eastern Time. I also have a Facebook group and a Facebook page. I'm on Instagram. I'm on Twitter. And I have a small Etsy shop. So if you're not up to anything, go check it out. I greatly appreciate it. Me and Sis say goodbye.